Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of PHP. So today we are going to learn how to create fetch weather data from open weather API. So we are going to use open weather API and we are trying to get all the data from the weather API and try to populate in the HTML, right? So let's get started. So here, here is the code of that one, right? This is basically we are using curl, okay, to get the response from this one after getting the response we are just showing it onto the html file nothing else okay so let's see what exactly the response is so before that we have to go with the api key and the city id so i'm going to add the city id here to be city id would be um let's add chandigarh and if for the API key, we need to create go for the open weather, <coughs> open weather. <coughs> so go to the open weather, okay. Leaving everything behind this, this uh, sign in. You need to create the API key. So create an account. Email anything. Password. Okay. create account get it market all I'm going to again market what is <coughs> okay email is already taken okay let me then log in So let's create a count of my other one. It's done. So nothing. Choose your purpose. Consulting. Save. So here we have API keys. Just copy this one. I'm going to put it over here. So let's add over the API key. Okay. Control C. We are going to go with HTML, JavaScript. So we will going to create <coughs> open terminal. Touch test dot PHP file and we are going to just paste it over here okay and uh, let's try to overview it 
to localhost javascript slash test dot php javascript then test dot php local javascript it's not there let's make it in a php code already i have php let's uh, paste it replace localhost php slash test dot php so you can see that the weather status humidity i think the data is not fetching correct fetching is not but the date and time is correct right now so let's see what exactly the parameters of r it is so let's check have a look on that <coughs> api go to the api then we have one call api this one professional current weather data api let's check what exactly they are calling 2.5 weather lat long and this one so they have this path units and this one right examples weather lat latitude and longitude okay and this is the response uh, any other one they have nothing then we can take the back part and uh, let's go for the api so what is the api doc of this one one call latitude longitude okay everything is based on the latitude longitude i guess so we need to pass the latitude and longitude also so we will get that part also so let's get the latitude and longitude get latitude and longitude So here I am going to pass my area. Okay, and uh, <coughs> here we can go with the API. Then we are going with uh, another part that is current weather data. Now we are going to add this one with latitude and longitude. Skipping the city ID. So here we go with this one. So this ID we don't require. This is ID. This we will make it as latitude. Latitude and longitude latitude l o n longitude equals to b this this make it dot dot and we will here add <coughs> longitude equal to this one okay so dollar longitude we are going to add it over here okay so let's add this city to be latitude <coughs> so latitude would be our this one so i have fetched the latitude so i'm going to pass it or whether you can if you want to make dynamic then get the current location and it automatically fetch the data of the latitude and longitude and pass it longitude latitude and longitude we have already added so let's add this latitude over here 
let's try to make it let's see weather status degree celsius is not coming what is the issue in that let's see what is the response We are doing in the different different file. That's the reason. Let's go and open that file. So here we have the weather classes there, temperature, everything is there, I guess. Let's make it a die over here and let's check. So here you can see that. Chandigarh weather because I'm Chandigarh right now. So they have a light rain and humidity and the wind, right? So <coughs> So this is how we can create a weather API. So it's very easy. Nothing uh, major on that. I have already described it So basically this is the call request that you have to take in care of it after getting all the data Okay, so you can print it and just render it so whether it is current time current date whether whether you here you can check the full body response. I will just print it out. Here you can go with the data, add the data and make it die. Okay. And let's check the response. You can see that we have a coordinates, latitude, longitude, weather. We have a rain description light rain icon you will get it okay main station everything will wind visibility clouds okay system time zone and the, uh, everything is there so you can populate the code accordingly right so this is how we are able to show the weather okay in your project so if you want such kind of requirement you can use that part right open weather api is most popular okay so you can use it okay so any query any issue any doubt let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day